礼 ，propriety, respectability, courtesy, appreciativeness, modesty, good manners, correctness. 三顾茅庐 During the Three Kingdoms period, Liu Bei he sought the advice of master strategist Zhuge Liang. Who stayed in retreat? Liu Bei personally went to Zhuge Liang, knocking on his door on three different occasions. Before Zhuge Liang opened the door and spoke with Liu Bei, touched by the great respect and propriety that Liu Bei showed to Zhuge Liang, who was yet unknown, Zhuge Liang finally agreed. To become Liu Bei's chief strategic advisor, Li or propriety means showing people the proper respect and courtesy while being humble. Li in English is courtesy, being respectful to one another.、Um, to me, that's very very basic. That's a starting point. Of how we can start business, how we can start a relationship,、uh, how we can start anything. So without that mutual respect, you simply can't go anywhere without it. As Li, I think of Li as respect, and I grew up in a family of teachers, and I never wanted to be a teacher in the U.S. because I felt that it was not respected. People horse around in class, and they're. Doing crazy things, and I just felt like it was very tiring to be a teacher. But then I came to China, and after being here for a couple of years and respecting all my teachers and seeing the respect they receive in class, which is a bow and lao shi, you call them teacher, and you are if you are not respectful, just don't be in class. That's basically how it works. So I think that is a universal value that we should extend to all of our teachers. Li propriety, also we know it. By the combination li yue, so、uh, the rights and the music, and、um, actually the rights and the music, they were representing the movements of the stars. So the regularities, the regulations. Idea was that by means of ritual, people would be enabled to、um, to come on terms with the universal ritual, so to speak, with the universal、uh, self-regulation or the ziran, the, the self-sowing of nature. 呃，礼呢，告诉我们的是人做人的这种谦让，呃，人与人间这种尊重，知书达理，文明礼貌。那么应用到我们的生活当中呢，其实我们习武者也不该是只是逞强斗狠，不只是在这个呃一介武夫的层面，那更多的是也是需要咱们这个人与人之间的这种呃礼貌处之